decimation and frequency algorithm or we call it as DAF F50 algorithm. In DAF F50 algorithm, X of K is decimated into small sequences. We know that DFT of X of N is given by X of K. Before applying decimation to X of K, we have to rearrange X of K to an appropriate form. Split the DFT formula into two summations. First summation for first n by 2 data points. Second summation for remaining n by 2 data points. Therefore, x of k can be written as summation of two sequences. The first sequence ranges from 0 to n by 2 minus 1. Second sequence ranges from n by 2 to n minus 1. Rearranging the second summation. By substituting n is equal to n plus n by 2, we get this expression. In the second summation, we split the WN term into two separate terms. Here WN power K capital N by 2 is independent of N, so we take it outside the summation. We know the value of WN. So the term WN power K capital N by 2 is equal to minus 1 power K. If we substitute this value in the previous equation, we get this new expression for x of k. Here we take w n power k n as the common term. First stage of decimation. Now let us split x of k into even and odd numbered samples. That is x of 2k and x of 2k plus 1. In equation number 1, let us substitute k is equal to 2k. Here w n power 2 k n can also be written as w n by 2 power k n. Now apply equation 1 for even numbered samples. That is substitute k is equal to 2 k plus 1. Here again we split the w n term into two separate terms. Here w n power 2 k n can also be written as w n by 2 power k n. Using equation 2 and 3, let us define two n by 2 point sequences g1 of n and g2 of n, where g1 of n is equal to x of n plus x of n plus n by 2, and g2 of n is equal to x of n minus x of n plus n by 2 multiplied with w n power small n. Using this in equation 2 and 3, we get x of 2k in terms of g1 of n and x of 2k plus 1 in terms of g2 of n. Use equation 4 and 5 to draw the first stage of decimation. Here n point DFT is divided into two n by 2 point DFTs. x of 2k is represented by this equation where k is equal to 0 to n by 2 minus 1 x of 2k plus 1 is represented by this equation where k is equal to 0 to n by 2 minus 1. Even values of x of k is represented in terms of g1 of n. Odd values of x of k is represented in terms of g2 of n. Where g1 of n is given by this equation and g2 of n is given by this equation. Input is given by small x of n g1 of 0 is equal to x of 0 plus x of 0 plus 4. Similarly for other values of g1 of n. g2 of 0 is equal to x of 0 minus x of 0 minus 4 multiplied with w8 power 0. Similarly for other values of g2 of n. Now let us see the second stage of decimation. In the first stage of decimation we splitted x of k into odd and even numbered samples. In the second stage of decimation, we split the even numbered samples further into odd and even numbered samples. And we split the odd numbered samples further into odd and even numbered samples. The subdivided samples are represented by capital G. Now let us take equation 2 as reference. X of 4k can be represented in terms of G1 of n. Let us assume P11 of n is equal to G1 of n 
plus g1 of n plus n by 4. Now let us take equation 3 as reference. x of 4k plus 2 can be represented by this equation. Let us assume p12 of n is equal to g1 of n minus g1 of n plus n by 4 multiplied with w n by 2 power n. Similarly, x of 4k plus 1 is represented by this equation. Now let us assume the term inside the bracket as p21 of n. Similarly, for x of 4k plus 3. Use equation 6, 7, 8 and 9 to draw the second stage of decimation. This is the first stage of decimation we have seen earlier. Using equation 6, we get x of 4k where k varies from 0 to n by 4 minus 1. p11 of n is given by this equation. p11 of 0 is equal to g1 of 0 plus g1 of 0 plus 2. Similarly for p11 of 1. P12 of n is given by this equation. P12 of 0 is equal to G1 of 0 minus G1 of 0 plus 4 multiplied by W of 4 power 0. Similarly for P12 of 1. Now let us supply equation 8 and 9 to represent X of 4k plus 1 and X of 4k plus 3 x of 4k plus 1 and x of 4k plus 3 can be written in terms of p21 of n and p22 of n. Now let us see the last stage of decimation. From equation 6 we write the expression for x of 4k. We know the expression for x of k. For 2 point DFT, n varies from 0 to n by 4 minus 1, that is 0 and 1. When k is equal to 0, we will get the value for x of 0. When k is equal to 1, we get the value for x of 4. We know w2 power 1 is equal to minus 1. Now let us draw the 2 point DFT. To maintain the uniformity, we include w2 power 0 which is actually equal to 1. Now let us draw the butterfly diagram for 8 point DAF FFT algorithm. This is the diagram we have seen in first and second stage of decimation. Now let us include the third stage of decimation. Therefore we have derived the butterfly diagram for 8 point DAF FFT algorithm.